Welcome to video number four. We're going to talk about sales funnel mapping. So at this time, you're going to understand what you have. You've basically taken all the information that you know about your products and splatted it on a wall. And that's, that's great because you don't need to organize it. And now it's time to take all that information and organize it into something that makes sense. So we're going to actually map it out and we're going to be creating a visual map basically because this is crucial to your success and being able to see what everything and how everything is laid out is going to help you actually move forward. So that way you know exactly what is ahead. What we found is most people quit 75% in. And the reason why most people quit is because they cannot see ahead. And this is the reason why we are creating a visual map. So we highly recommend that you use either a flowchart system or a mind mapping software. You can use anything you would like, but in this case, we're going to be using a software called lucid chart. It's not expensive. It does cost money. It's about four to five bucks per month, but it's definitely something that is going to help you motivate you, help you create that blueprint so you know exactly what to do. Because I will say, once you start setting things up within JVZoo, things can, can become overwhelming. But if you have an idea of, okay, I'm at this point, I need to get to this point, it's going to make a lot more sense. So I'm going to hop on over to lucidchart.com right now and show everything to you in action. Okay, so taking into consideration what you have written down in the previous video, what we need to do now is just drag and drop the front end offer here. So front end offer. And I want you to be specific. So you might want to write down, okay, this is a video course, for example. And, or maybe this is a software or something. We'll just say, We'll do software and then maybe the one time offer is a video course, maybe advanced level it's teaching them how to use the software to an advanced level. And then maybe you can have like a Facebook group or, or some, some, some community. So Facebook group or community. And then of course, maybe, we have like one on one coaching. So price wise, maybe this one's like 497 or 497. Maybe this is a monthly $47 per month. And the video course, maybe that's 97 one-time fee. And the software, let's say that's uh, $37 one-time fee. So you want to make sure that you understand, okay, is it a one-time fee? Is it a monthly fee? Is it a recurring fee? How much of it is a recurring fee? Is it a monthly or is it quarterly? Is it maybe monthly for six months and then it stops? or is what is it so you want to make sure you jot that down you also want to make sure like are you offering a trial first maybe the facebook group you want to do like a dollar trial for seven days and then do it for 47 dollars per month you could do that as well so i could show you how to do all that and uh, when i show you all the details that you're going to need in the next video. But right now it's just a matter of jotting down everything that you can think of. So front end offer, one time offer. So we want to mark these. So one time offer OTO one, OTO two, and literally you can get really complex if you want, but at the end of the day, I would just work on this right now and then you can add these later. Now, typically if somebody Let's say somebody buys this, then they get offered the one-time offer, right? But let's say, for example, somebody doesn't want the one-time offer. Okay. So if somebody doesn't want, let's say this video course has like 
25 videos and it's an advanced course. And if somebody says no, you can offer what we call a downsell. So this would be downsell one. So you could have downsell two, three, and more. Or you can simplify it and just keep it this way and that's it. But basically, if somebody buys it, they're presented with this. If they say no and they click the no thanks, they are then forwarded over here. So it's going to look like, like this. And then if they buy that, you could redirect them up here. Now, we're just getting really, really complex. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave it like that. In fact, I'm just going to highlight this right here. And we're going to highlight this green because green light we're going to do this and I'm going to make these red so we can do these later or pink like that all right so you want to color code it as well I like lucid chart because I can color code things and I can say okay this is what we're going to do we're going to do this later and and in addition to that what I like is this Okay, so if I zoom in a little bit, if I right click an item, I can add a note. So within the note, I can add the sales page equals, you know, http colon slash slash your domain dot coms. And then the download page or the thank you page equals http colon slash slash your domain dot com slash like thanks something dot HTML. So that way you have a record of everything. What I found with other mind mapping softwares is that oftentimes you have to create another item and another item and it just gets messy. So with Lucidchart, I can store all my sales page and download page in here and do the same for over here for the one time offer. So we'll right click add note add that in here and that way when it comes time for those items we can always refer back to them so that's all you really need to do now and once you have this in hand and I don't want to make it more complex than it <laughs> needs to be so once you have this in hand you've written it down you are good to go now you will notice the next items that you need. So you need to have your sales page, you need to have your download page. And if, even if you don't have these items yet, it's okay. You will know what you need to go and get and come back later. All right, so now that you have an idea of, okay, this is our game plan. This is our tack plan. We are gonna do this first, or we're gonna do this first. And then we're gonna add another product. And then once we have conquered and ruled that, and successfully that's in our brain, you feel comfortable, then you can add the down cells, then you can add more one-time offers and make it a very profitable campaign. Uh, but start with these first, and then we'll go from there. So in the next video, we're gonna talk about the things that you are gonna need, the sales page, the download page, the support, email or the support desk, uh, which by the way, we'll talk more about like what help desk we recommend and all of that. All right. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by all super info.